A roundabout planned for one of Fairhope's busiest intersections is moving forward faster than originally proposed. The completion date for the project at Highway 104 and Section Street bumped up by almost a year. As WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, Fairhope's mayor is hoping this new design will keep more drivers safe. Next year, the Highway 104 and Section Street intersection north of downtown Fairhope will look much different. A roundabout is known to keep to help with um, to help with traffic accidents, plus to keep that traffic flowing. And that intersection, as you have all those um, roads coming in to one area, it really is not safe. The process of building a roundabout here is moving faster than originally planned. Engineering will now start this year instead of 2023, bringing much needed improvements and relief to one of Fairhope's busiest intersections. It is a dangerous intersection. You know, you have three roads, actually four areas that are coming into that intersection. There have been some some really bad wrecks there, and um, really looking forward to having that roundabout there just for the safety of it. Mayor Sullivan says the roundabout should take about a year to build once construction starts. Construction is scheduled to begin early next year, and based on current plans, the roundabout should be open towards the end of 2023. The project is funded by the Eastern Shore Metropolitan Planning Organization, and it's one Mayor Sherry Sullivan supports. She says roundabouts have improved traffic flow and have helped to reduce the number of accidents along County Road 13. Now she's ready for those traffic trends to trickle closer to the downtown district. In Fairhope, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.